Good afternoon, everybody. I am so sorry that I didn't post yesterday. I really, 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 really was not proud of my vlog from previous day. I think it was what it was. And I didn't, yeah, I didn't like the vlog from two days ago. And then yesterday I didn't vlog at all just because I hated that vlog so much and I didn't do anything yesterday. So, I mean, I did do laundry, but who wants to see that? Let me be honest with you, I, okay, I love Vlogmas and stuff like that, but, but I just get really tired of posting videos I'm not proud of. Is anyone else in the same boat as me? I, I literally hate editing them. I feel like nobody cares to watch them. Nobody cares about my life, you know, that much to just watch me talk about the same things every single day. So, yeah we went to target today uh me and giovanni did he just took off to work uh, like five minutes ago so i thought i'd pull the camera out because today i'm going to hang stockings so i went and grabbed the rest of the stockings today and then i also grabbed some hooks and tape and stuff like that just for wrapping presents and everything and then we also did get a new roll of uh what is it paper paper for presents wrapping paper <laughs> Oh my gosh. And then I also got some like, um, what is it called? Stocking stuffers. Guys, I do not know what I'm doing. I am not in the Christmas mode, I guess. Okay, so I went and got mine. I love this stocking so much. Plus, all of Target's stockings are 30% off right now. So I remember Giovanni's was white and it had like red. So I was like, I don't want to get the same exact one, but... Yeah, I don't know. I just wanted something different just to make it look cuter together So I thought it'd be cute to get the red one because they did have like a white one like this with fur But I was like, let me just get the red one just to be super cute and it looks so nice and Christmassy This one is my mother's this one also has poof balls that hang off of it So I thought it was super cute for my mom and then this is for my brother and my brother Kyle My brother Antonio and then this is for my little sister Catalina. I think she had took taken hers from last year, so I went and got her another one. You know what? Dude, why am I so... I'm so sorry. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to speak, but I am so out of breath. I'm sorry. I'm really trying here, but, like, I'm just, I'm just out of breath trying to explain everything to you guys. Oh, my goodness. But, anyways, the point of this whole conversation is I got new stockings. Not all of them. I had a couple. I have a few of them from last year, but... I got all new stockings for the people that didn't have any. So yeah, these are the people that are gonna be joining us for Christmas this year. My brother Kyle is going to be coming here this weekend, so we'll be going to pick him up sometime this weekend. All right, and then last year we put our stockings up here, but this is in the way. So I don't know what to do. I kind of have an idea. So I was thinking maybe I could spread these out on the wall right here. Today I'm gonna go out also because I need to get Giovanni's Christmas present. I haven't went and gotten anything for him yet. Obviously I won't show you guys, but I don't know what to get him. And I, ah, it's just so hard. I've gotten him everything every single year, so. All right, but I'm gonna set you guys up and you're gonna, you're gonna watch me struggle to put these on actually first i don't have okay so i didn't get much stocking stuffers because i noticed my mom went and got a bunch of stuff so i'll probably get like a couple of things from different stores for each of their stockings this weekend i will go do that but um for now i did grab some candy to go inside and then like little candy canes to go outside of it but let's fill these up hello i'm jim rockwell our program is people in jazz and today our man in jazz is Wes Montgomery. And many years ago, about 1959, well it was indeed in 1959, a dear old friend was... Alright, and now that that is done, um, it's time to hang these bad boys on the wall. ...with whom I had been associated, owned a record company, which was Riverside, sent me a demonstration record of uh, an album he was about to release. And it was a guitarist then quite unknown. It was West Montgomery. Gum Gum Ta-da! And it is 
is complete. I think it looks so cute, except they obviously need to be filled up more, but just candies inside of them for right now. And then I put candy canes in each of our stockings. So, yeah. I actually don't know if I like them outside, but we're going to fill them up first and see where they fit. I think it'll fill out more and they won't look so droopy like that. But I love it. I actually like the stockings right there rather than up there. It makes the house look more decorated. <laughs> and then also, I think me and Joanna are going to start wrapping some presents tomorrow. Because uh, Christmas is next week. Coming up very, very fast on us, guys. Sorry, I got presents in there. But um, very, very fast on all of us. So I wasn't actually prepared for Christmas that much this year. I feel like I barely celebrated and stuff. And I'm... Really late to up wrapping presents. I haven't wrapped anything. My tree it just looks so bare. It's just embarrassing for my life. All right, I think I figured out where I'm gonna go to go look for some presents for Giovanni. If not there, I think I'm gonna go to Dick's Sporting Goods, but we will see. I literally was walking out of the house, locked it up, and I almost forgot you guys, <laughs> but. <laughs> I'm headed out now. Alrighty guys, I made it. And I don't know if I'll vlog in there because I'm just a shy person and I will probably never ever get used to this feeling. <laughs> and shopping trip was a success. Okay, just got to the mall. And um, I look around. Hopefully I find something. But... Giovanni's a tough guy to shop for. Well, not really, I guess. I could find him a lot of stuff in here. This is literally his favorite store, Dick's Sporting Goods. My baby loves this store. Mwah. If I were Giovanni, I would go to the sportwear section first. All right, guys. I'm home. So first things first, gotta... I don't know why I just talked to the lisp. Gotta turn on the duckeries monastery. Ew, you just saw a whole double chin. I'm sorry. Next thing I do, open the blinds. I can get to them. Jeez. Okay. Yeah, we open the blinds. Some freaking light in this piece. <laughs> I hate when it's super dark in here. Um, turn the lamp on. And we're about to wrap some Christmas presents, folks. And then let the rice pies out of her cage. All right. Now, now we're getting somewhere. Ew, that was so ugly. <laughs> and now we're getting somewhere. So I stopped at the mailbox on the way home because I got a package from Baby Bye Kira. <laughs> Oops, I stepped on her squishy. So it's another baby blanket, of course. <laughs> Oh my god, so cute. I love the way that they package this. Isn't this just so adorable? I love it. Um, so, I bought a lot of stuff for Black Friday for the baby. <laughs> I, If you haven't noticed, I didn't get too much for myself. But, um, I've been wanting this blanket for a minute. So, really excited I got it, finally. Oh my god, this package is so cute. I don't want to rub it. But I just want to see the blankie. Oh, this is so cute. Okay. So the blankie, the blankie I got because I didn't know if I wanted to get this or not. Just because it's got pink and blue. But, so like if I have a boy, do I really want to give my boy a, a, a blanket with pink on it? But it doesn't matter. He won't care. I mean, he's not going to be like, Mom, I don't like this. You know what I mean? So... I thought it was so, so cute. Plus, it's like gender neutral. It's blue, pink, you know. It's kind of fun because don't know what the gender is. So, yeah, I think this is super cute. It also it also can attach to the um, the teether that I got. So, it is about this big. If you can imagine, a baby's like, poof. So, this can wrap probably um, half around my baby. <laughs> but I think this is so cute and it is so soft. All of her blankets are just so soft and it's ridiculous. I love the mink side. Is this the mink? I think it's what it's called. 
but I love this material she uses. It's so soft. I want to get like a whole blanket this this material. But I love it. It's so cute. Thank you so much, Kira. Super excited, my little squishy poo. My little Squishmaster 5000. I'm gonna go put it with their collectibles. I'll be right back. All right. And uh, I'm gonna pull the stuff out because I'm gonna start wrapping presents. I'm not gonna wrap all the presents today. I'm just gonna wrap the ones that involve Giovanni <laughs> because I don't want him to see what I got him. So I'm gonna wrap it before he comes home tonight. Can you stop looking your butt? Alrighty, tidy. So it's all, it's about that time, guys. It's about that time. Oh, I got this thing for 10 bucks at Target. Super worth it if you guys wanted to get a set. I don't know if they're all out yet, but it came, comes with like four rolls of, what is it? Wrapping paper. <laughs> and then it comes with little cute bows and little tags. I think that this is so cute. All right, time to wrap presents. <laughs> I did get him some stuff, but I put it in his stocking, just a couple of things that he did want. So, yeah, I hope he likes them. Move them to the tree. Ugh. Okay, put the first Christmas present under the tree. Okay. Second present. So cute now. It has presents. Actually, I have presents under that tree. Sorry, I put them so tight in there, but yeah. Sorry, guys. It is a wild hater, but I got hungry, so I made some chicken noodle soup. <laughs> I'm so excited. I haven't had this since um, a little chicken noodle soup. Chicken noodle soup with the soda on the side. How are you guys doing today? Hmm? Oh my gosh, you're running with the balagana out today. What am I gonna do with this guy? Like, what am I gonna just, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna like sell him or something. He just not know what he's doing. I'm just kidding. Okay, so I love, I love the chicken noodle soup, but the best way to eat it is with crackers. Thank God Giovanni hasn't eaten them all. Because he eats these crackers all the freaking time. It's in the work. He eats them. Like how rude. So I just crunch them up my hand and I just, Oh my god, I'm so freaking mad. I forgot. I was on the phone with Giovanni last night and I forgot I was eating applesauce. I love this applesauce and I'm so mad that I didn't finish it. Good job, Clarice. Good job. And I'm gonna put some water in the fridge. I put like two at a time to get them nice and cool. And then uh, put them right there for whenever I need them. Easy access. I hate this light so much. It's like dim lighting. It's like not even cute. So, hi guys. Hello, hello, hello. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Like my sweater. David Dobrik. Anyways, I wanted to talk to you guys. Hold on a second. <laughs> I wanted to talk to you guys about something very important. And, um, I'd like to know what you guys think about it. So, me and Gio, you know, Gio and I, oh, and Squishy, we're trying to move this year, like we were telling you, but, um, I mean, this coming up year, but I don't know where to go, because I was thinking, should we buy a house? And I told you guys we'd we're planning on buying a house we still plan on buying a house but like we're so young we don't want to like rush into it plus like there's still things that we want to do well not things but like we still want to travel and stuff like that so 
I feel like, okay, to be honest with you, um, I want to move to Florida. And uh, I've been talking about this for a really long time now. I'll give you guys a little backstory. I've been obsessed with Florida for probably like 15 years now. Like, I've gone to Florida every single year since I was little. Okay. And I've always, no matter how many times I've gone every single year, I never get tired of it. Like, I love everything about Florida. The only thing I have to say about Florida, like my only complaint, is people are psychopaths when they drive. <laughs> like, seriously. So me and Giovanni are talking about moving there. <laughs> We have like a whole plan set up. Last time we were supposed to move, um, I think August of this, yeah. So we were supposed to move July or August of this year, but um, Giovanni financially couldn't do it. So, I mean, probably I couldn't either, but um, we were thinking of uh, planning it now so that we could financially do it by July. And um, baby will be like three months old or something, two months old. Which is a really big adjustment for me. It's just, it'll be hard as a new mom to go move to a completely new place with a baby. <laughs> so, but we'll see how it goes and stuff. And we will let you guys know, we'll keep you informed. But that's not a long time. Um, until a long time from now anyways. So, I just kind of wanted to bring it up really quick. Um, Giovanni must be calling me. Be right back. I'm on the phone with Gio, guys. Hi, Gio. Say hi to my blue. Hello. Hello. Hello, stuck at work. <laughs> okay, I just got off the phone with Gio. Finished my comida. <laughs> and now I don't know what I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna continue watching YouTube. I think I'm gonna upload this video tomorrow to be on. Oh shoot. I have to upload this video tomorrow. <laughs> uh, I was gonna upload it tomorrow, but tomorrow's Wednesday, guys. So that means I have to upload this tonight because tomorrow is my weekly update upload. <laughs> Time is just flying by, guys. I was just telling Gio, we got like. Four months and 26 days left till the baby is here or less. That is literally insane. It, how did it go by so fast? Like how? <laughs> I mean, technically I'm already halfway there in about a week, so. Yeah! Alright, then I'm going to kick it. Watch some YouTube. KK Baby J. I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. I'm just flapping my freaking stupid, ugly, fat jaw to you guys. 2020 is going to be a good year, guys. Am I right? Am I right? Oh my god. Are you kidding me? My... Oh my gosh, guys. My memory card is... is Yo, my freaking memory card just filled up while I was talking to you guys. That is freaking awesome. That was so frustrating. I don't even know if what you guys... I don't even know if you guys heard anything I just said, but uh, yeah, I'm just gonna kick it with my Christmas tree, my stockings, and uh, watch some Kai Kai and Baby J. I don't know why I'm talking like that. Okay, uh, watch some KK and Baby J. All right, but since I gotta put this up, I guess this is just gonna have to be just it's gonna have to cut it for now. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching today's vlog, and I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys tomorrow bye guys darling you